Hey everyone, today I wanted to share with you some quick and easy tips to turn your eyeshadows into eyeliners. Eyeliners, especially having a variety of different colors and shades of eyeliners, it can get pretty pricey and expensive, so I'm going to show you some cost-effective ways of turning your eyeshadows into an assortment of eyeliners. Before we get into my little tutorial tips, tricks, what have you, I just wanted to thank everybody who entered my recent giveaway. The giveaway is still going, so if you don't know what I'm talking about, check out my previous video, my giveaway video. It's specifically back to school makeup essentials. I'm giving all the products in that video away, and I just got such a great response from it. You guys are amazing. You left really sweet comments. I have a lot of new subscribers and viewers, and I'm just so happy that you guys checked out the video and my channel and decided to subscribe and enter the giveaway. Let's go ahead and get into today's video. First, obviously, you want to grab your eyeshadow. I'm just using a basic black eyeshadow from Jane Cosmetics. Today, I'm going to show you three different ways to use eyeshadow and create eyeliner. The first one is to take a thicker angled brush and you're just going to tap it into the eyeshadow product. Then you just put that right onto your eyelid and create the eyeliner look you're going for. This method creates a much softer line, so if you want to have it look a little more natural, this is a good route to take. For the second method, you're actually going to use liquid. I like to use eye drops. You can also just use a couple drops of water. I prefer eye drops, it's just easier. Dip the brush into the water, and then you're gonna dip the brush into the eyeshadow. I like to kind of use the side. It doesn't really matter. It's not gonna damage the product at all. It just makes the finish of the top of the eyeshadow look a little different, so I'm just a little OCD about that. Then again, you're just going to apply this to where you want it on your eyelid, and there is a little fallout sometimes with this, so I just blew on the eyeliner here. The third and final method is to take some clear mascara. This is gonna create more of a gel eyeliner look. I prefer this method to the other two just because it tends to stay a little bit longer than the other two methods. You're just gonna unscrew the cap of your clear mascara. You're going to spread the product onto a paper towel or a napkin or something. Then you're gonna take a thinner angled brush, just dip that right into the gel. Next. Grab the eyeshadow, again, use kind of the rim or the edge if you want to, like me. Dip your brush back into the eyeshadow, and then again, just like the other two steps, you're gonna apply that to the area of your eyelid that you want your eyeliner to go. And I just wanted you to see the differences between these three different methods. So the bottom one's a little more natural, and the top two are a little more gel-like. All right, this is where I get into my little cautionary tale. I will say that this works much better when you use a highly pigmented eyeshadow. When you're using something not as pigmented, like this e.l.f. shadow right here, it's a little harder to use these different methods. This first method hardly works at all for this light color with hardly any pigment. The second method where you use liquid like eye drops or a little bit of water works a little better. You can't see it right now, but as soon as I move my hand into the light, you'll be able to see it much easier. It's just I had too much light on this area of my hand. Using the clear mascara to create a more gel liner works pretty well also, but it's definitely a much more subtle look with these e.l.f. eyeshadows. I wanted to show you a MAC loose eyeshadow. These work really well too. Some people actually like to take eyeshadow and scrape a little bit off, but an easier way is to use something that's already loose, like this loose eyeshadow powder. So for method one, I'm just gonna take this eyeshadow powder, put my thicker angled brush right into the product that was left over in the cap, and then just apply that to the area of the eyelid that I would like it. Here's what this MAC shadow looks like when you use eye drops or water. And then finally, this is what it looks like when you use the clear mascara. I just wanted to show one last eyeshadow product. This is Urban Decay, and it's a very, very light blue color. Since the pigment is pretty good on this eyeshadow, you can create a good look. I will say the first method has way too much fallout and not very much color payoff, so I wouldn't recommend that. The second method is a little better using the eye drops or water. And then the third method also is pretty good using the clear mascara. Now angling this into the light, you can see all three methods here and that the top two are a little easier to see. 
So those are all of my tips and tricks for turning your eyeshadows into eyeliners. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please click the like button so that I know to do more kind of tip trick videos like this in the future. You can also leave a comment below if you have a trick that I did not mention in this video for taking eyeshadows and turning them into eyeliner. Other than that, I hope you're having a really great day and I will see you next time.